Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So today we have an unboxing and this one is from Craft Buddy Crystal Art. And the good people at Craft Buddy um, asked me if they could send me some um, free goodies to have a look at with you and show on my channel. And of course I said yes, because as you know, they are one of my favourite companies. Um, it's how I got into diamond painting through using their uh, card kits, their products. So I've slit the box so that I can get into it a bit easier. So let's have a look and see what's inside. See what they've sent. Okay, no. Oops, hide that. That's my details. You don't want to see that. Right, so we have, oh, look at that. It's Dragon Valor, which is the Anne Stokes, um, which is a licensed artist. Craft Buddy only use licensed art uh, notebook. So we'll have a look at that in a second. Oh, we've got some Disney. So we've got uh, a Disney uh, Dory and Marlin craft kit, uh, card kit, sorry. So, yeah, we'll have a closer look at that one. And, oh, we've got Minnie Mouse. Yay, we love Minnie Mouse. Who doesn't love Minnie Mouse? Yay. So we'll have a look at those. These are the new kits that have only just recently come out. So, wonderful. Oh, look at that. Wow. So we have, oh, it's a giant card. Wow, that's wonderful. And it's a unicorn. Oh, great. Okay, so we'll have a closer look. Right, let me get this box out of the way and let's go through these and do a really good look at them. Okay, so we'll go through them in the order that uh, I received them. As I say, full disclosure, these were sent to me free of charge for me to review on my channel and to show you all. And as a thank you, Craft Buddy have given us a 15% discount code. Um, it is L-I-Z, Liz, 10, no spaces, capital letters, no spaces. I'll put it down below in the description so that you can uh, use that when you wish. So yeah, that's brilliant. I've got some free products and I've got a 15% voucher for you as well. And if you do use my code, I may get a small commission from that as well. So I just want everybody to know that. So there is full disclosure. Right. So let's get on with this. So look at this. How gothic and uh, steampunky even is that with all that lovely like magenta uh, dark maroon colour and all the swirls. So these, I love these kits. Um, I think you'll have seen me, if you've watched any of my other videos, unboxing um, notebook kits before. And they just make a fantastic presence. And it's a useful present as well. It's practical. It's not like somebody giving somebody um, a picture to hang on the wall. It might be one that they're not quite keen on. People will always use a notebook. We all like writing notes, even if it's a shopping list that you forget and leave on the fridge and get to the shop and think... I've forgotten my shopping list again. Maybe that's just me. Hey -ho. <laughs> okay. Um, partial crystal. It's uh, 26 centimetres by 18 centimetres. It's the same size as my 10 inch iPad. So great. It just slots into uh, my handbag with my iPad that I've got. Um, they say eight plus, but I've mentioned previously my six year old granddaughter and my five year old great nephew do actually do diamond painting, um, obviously under supervision. Um, and if they're using scissors to open the packets, then uh, obviously be careful with scissors. But it's a great way for them to learn how to um, recognise letters and numbers as well, because your drills are all uh, either letters or numbers on the little packets. You've got all your instructions on the back there. There's the details of the Facebook group there, which is wonderful. I think there's over 10,000 members now, which is great. And everybody's so lovely and helpful and shows all the different things that they've made using the Craft Buddy products. So, you know, if you're wanting to possibly think, oh, I'm not sure what that's going to look like when it's done, pop along to the Facebook group and possibly somebody will have already done it. Or if you want me to uh, purchase it, because I've got most of their products anyway now. <laughs> then uh, I can always look at purchasing it and doing it and showing it for you. Or I can unbox it on my channel and show you. Okay, so let's get into this kit and have a look. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, see, the boxes are great. They're just so professionally done, all the Craft Buddy products. It just makes you feel special when you open them. I love them. Right, you do get a little... Um, leaflet that shows you what's in your kit which is your notebook your tray 
your um, drill pen for picking up your gems and your drills, your little wax and your bags of crystals. And then again, you've got your instructions on how to diamond paint on here as well. So you've got it twice there and it's in a few different languages as well. So if you're sending it abroad to one of your pen pals or friends, if people still have pen pals, then you can do that as well. Okay, so look how clear that drill field is. It is absolutely wonderful. There's no guide circles on this one either, which... Oh, there is possibly around there, sorry, my eyesight, but around the darker ones, you can't really see them. But that is such a clear drill field. You've got your cover on the top. Now, what I tend to do with these covers, um, and I'm getting into the habit of doing it, is putting a sticker on the side um, that is already face up. So now I'm going to pop that little sticker in that corner there. So when I take, if I do accidentally take this cover off completely, I know which way to put it back down. There are two sides to these plastic. I know you look at it and you think, well, it just looks the same, put it down anyway. But if you put it down the wrong way up, then you will find it will stick and it'll be very difficult to get off and it may take your glue um, off from where your drills go. So just a little heads up. It's just something I've got into the habit of doing as I open them now. If it's one I know I'm going to be doing soon, I just put my little sticker or as I start doing one, I put a little sticker on the right side so that I know whichever side that sticker is on is the side that I need to uh, keep on top and the other side goes on my drill field. But that is wonderful. Look at that really gothic. Look at all those circles. And uh, I'm not quite sure what these are called. I'm so I'm sure somebody will tell me. Um, it looks like we've got larger gems here as well. And the detail is just wonderful all along there. Great. I would say this is uh, for male or female, either boys or girls. Um, you know, anybody who's into, say, the, the game Dungeons and Dragons, anybody who's into Game of Thrones, that's been very, very popular recently. I haven't actually seen an episode of Game of Thrones. So, wow, maybe I'm that one person. I don't know, maybe I'm not on my own. So let's uh, measure, as I say, I have told you what size it said on the box that the um, notebook was, but for fairness terms, let's just have a look and make sure that it is correct. So yeah, we're 18 centimetres, which is about seven inches in width there. And we are 10 centimetres that way, which is 26 centimetres. So a really good size notebook. Some of them aren't as uh, large as this that you get from other places. Um, these all are hard backed as well. They've got a lovely, nice hard cover. So it makes it harder wearing and it's not going to bend in your bag and end up with curled up pages and things because it's got a good sturdy cover, all properly bound. You've got your Craft Buddy logo on the back there and then you've got your crystalartkit.com on the back. And also this little code here is the code that refers to your packets of diamonds or drills that you're using. So if you can see there, the number on the drills, which is C-A-N-J-10, is exactly the same. And you'll find that number on every packet of them. So if you do get them uh, separated from the project that you're working on, then you can just check your code and make sure. So that's those, okay. Now there's 50 pages, double-sided pages in each notebook. They're lovely bound at the front with the facing covers. Really good quality paper. That's just that little bit thicker, so it just gives you that luxury texture. I love them. And then the pages are all fully lined all the way through, all 50 pages which is great and again you're lovely finishing off at the back as well with your nice thick, thick cover sheets it just gives it that little bit special it makes you feel special when you're opening one of these in that lovely box and then opening the book and seeing that special front cover they do all come lined as well um, and then if you look at it the other way around you can see there's little dots 
just all the way along the bottom there. Now they're at one centimetre increments and they're at the top and the bottom of the page. So what you can do is actually line, if you want in one centimetres and make it into squares, you can do, or just make your boxes. You can put, say, the name of your diamond painting, the date you purchased it, the date you completed it, how much it cost, and tick if you've finished it. Or you could do your accounts in here, um, you know, whatever you're wanting to do. Don't work out how much you've spent on diamond painting though. Uh, and if you do, certainly don't tell your other half. <laughs> okay, um, and then to finish off, you do get that lovely satin ribbon, which is even lovely finished off at the end look. So there's no fraying on that at all. Wonderful. So you can keep your place in your book. So that's your notebook, lovely hardback, great quality these. And then, and I'm not just saying that because uh, Craft Buddy have sent me these um, free of charge to review. If you look back at any of my other videos before they sent these, you will hear me saying the same things. Um, I have always had a soft spot for a Craft Buddy because it is how I got into diamond painting using their first crystal art kits uh, for making cards. So I know the quality and I do come back to them time and time again. Um, I have got a lot of their products. <laughs> okay. I'm pleased to keep bringing out new ones because I need new cards every year to send people. <laughs> right, let's have a look at these uh, drills and the crystals in them. So we have a mixture on this one. Okay, how many colours have we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So there's 10 different uh, gems and crystals on this one. And they're all lettered from A to uh, J, sorry. So I had um, eye operations at the back of end of last year. So um, my eyesight isn't brilliant, but I can still diamond paint. And getting a kit like this with lovely clear symbols makes everything so much easier for me. And lovely big letters on the back, it's as well helps. <laughs> Okay, so we've got the black, which of course we're going to have black when it's gothic. And then all your different greys. Look at those. There is one, two, three, four, five different grey shades there, if you can see those. So you're going to get your gradients. And by doing that, by putting the drills as different colours and different shades... It's going to graduate all your different picture, uh, all your picture, and make it pop out and really make it 3D and really make it sparkle. You do get that depth of colour and that depth on your drills and for your picture. And then the drills in between look, all these reds. So I have it all H, H and G. Yeah. So all the red and the like burgundy. Um, colour the wine colour here are all going to be your gems your crystal gems so those dark colours are really going to show up against those sparkly gems and just give it that real oh wonderful feeling that dragon is going to look fab love that love that and then your bigger gems oh got plenty of these goodness me so that's i and j so you've got your bigger ones and your smaller ones in the middle look at that you only actually need four of those J's, you can see there's two at the top and two at the bottom. Oh, well, that huge bag, so there's going to be lots left. I do like having ones left over. And then even these look the eyes, we've got three, six, nine, twelve of them, and there's plenty in there. There's a lot more than twelve uh, gems in that bag. Large faceted red gems. Oh, they'll be great for coming up for Christmas. Wait and see what projects I've got coming up for Christmas. But yeah, I'll definitely be, yeah. Using those when I finish this, the leftovers won't go to waste. Okay, so yeah, that's wonderful. Love that. And then your little toolkit. It's better than a standard toolkit. You do get these little bit extras with Craft Buddy. Just open this one. And it is great. You've got everything you need here. Sorry about the crinkling. But everything you need here to get you started so if you want to give this as a present um somebody can just use all they would need is a packet of scissors for opening the packets of the uh, drills and the gems other than that they've got everything here they need to do with this kit and it's something that you can just sit on your knee and do possibly a couple of hours 
um, to do this if you did it all at once. You know, and it, you've got such a good practical present at the end of it that they can use as a notebook um, or a set even for yourself. So you've got your little tray to put your gems into. It's just your little standard tray and your little bit of your wax to put in your pen. You get loads of baggies. Look at all those which are your little grip seal bags. So as you're opening, your, what I do is I open my packet, I put the empty packet into here, put the drills into my tray, and then when I finish using the drills, I put them in the bag so that I've still got the letter and all the code numbers and everything in case I've missed one of the letters, which I do quite often. Do you do that? I let me know down in the comments below, or is it just me? You think you've finished with the letter, you pack it away and you think, oh, I've missed one and I have to get them all out again. So just putting them in the little grip seal bags, just it makes them easily accessible. OK, so love that. Thank you, Craft Buddy. That's one. It's not possibly one I would have chosen myself um, because I am more girly fluffy. But I think this is going to look superb and you may convert me into gothic and dragons. Okay, so let me just pop that one to one side and we'll have a look at the next kit. Okay, let's have a look at the next one. So we've got Minnie on holiday and Dory and Marlin. Um, I think this must be from the second film, which I have not seen. Um, I'm not up to date on all my Disney at the moment because with lockdown and COVID, I've not had the grandchildren. Um, maybe I should just sit and watch them on my own. <laughs> But I do know quite a few of the Disney films practically off by heart from seeing them so many times. Anyway, this is licensed Disney artwork. So Craft Buddy have got a license to be able to sell these products to you. You can't unfortunately sell them on yourself, but you can make and um, gift anything that you make from the kits. So let's have a look at these. OK, let's have a look at Minnie Mouse first. Oh, look. That is the uh, eight cards that Craft Buddy have got available at the moment. If you pop onto their website, it's uh, craftbuddylimited.co.uk or if you follow them on Facebook or Instagram, it's at Crystal Card Kit and you'll see lots of uh, other things available there as well. Um, that's your eight that are available at the moment. I have got an unboxing video on the full eight of those. If you do want to see them, I'll put a link down below. Uh, so let's open this one and have a look. I think these are wonderfully packaged. Sorry, I always open these really, really carefully because I like to keep them. <laughs> I keep everything. I'm sure to anybody that remembers uh, the Wombles, I was a Womble in a former life because I just tend to pick up and collect everything um, and don't like throwing anything away. OK, so your kit comes with your lovely card. Now, these are 7 inch by 7 inch. Just show you. Yep, 7 inch is 18 centimetres by 18 centimetres, 7 inches. And they're what we call a partial. So there's only on this one the leaves and Minnie Mouse that are um, that you put your drills on, that you put any gems on, uh, which means all the background around it. Oops, get a hold of that, Liz. Is just plain. There's no stickiness on there. It is only where you see the letters um, that there is any sticky, and that's where you're going to be putting all your gems, all your drills. Okay, again, I'm going to just put a little sticker on the front cover. This is just a habit I've got into so that I know which side is which. It's so easy when you're doing a smaller project to get carried away and take the full cover off and you really don't want to be putting it down the wrong way around. I speak from experience. <laughs> OK, they're a lovely blank inside. Again, excellent quality card. I don't know if you can hear that. I would think at least a 300 uh, GSM. I'm sorry, American uh, viewers, I'm not sure um, what that is in American pounds. I'll try and work it out and convert it for you. Um, it's blank, so you can just write uh, on the inside or you can stamp a greeting or you can use a peel off sticker or one of the um, greeting stickers that you can buy these days. Or you can do as I like to do and use a piece of uh, like paper and uh, put like an insert in it and then write or put your greeting on the insert. 
Okay, uh, again, similar to the notebook, you do have your code number on the back where I put the drills. Oh, there, do you know? Blind as a bat. Right, so if you look again on the back of your card there, you've got DNY807 and DNY807 is on all the gems, all the gem packets and all the drill packets there. So you can see every single one. You've got your website details there, craftbuddyshop.com. So that's where you need to be going to purchase um, any of these products. And again, don't forget you've got your 15% off if you do use my code. Thank you very much if you do. Um, and then you've got your Mickey and Friends and your licensed Disney there and your Crystal Art license there as well and your lovely little Craft Buddy logo. Okay, I love that one. Minnie Mouse with her flamingos there. She's definitely a holiday girl. Look at those eyelashes. I'd love some eyelashes like that, girls. Just your um, same toolkit as the one that came with the notebook. You do have uh, what they call a three play, so I don't know if I mentioned that um, on the end of your pen. And that is so uh, if you're wanting to pick up more than one of the gems or drills at once, you would put your wax into that end there and pick up more than one and you can put them down. It tends to be more if you're doing the larger canvases um, because you need quite a few uh, together to be able to put them down at once. But also it's quite a handy way uh, for picking up larger crystals because you've got a larger surface area of wax in the end here. So it does tend to pick up a little bit better than your single placer. Again, baggies, uh, you'll have your little square of wax and your little green boat there. So everything you need to get started. Okay, let's have a look at these drills. Oh, these look superb. Look at that. I can see more sparkle than ever from just looking at them now. Okay, so we've got black drills for her ears and the sides of her face and her nose and her arms and legs. And we've got like a really pale peachy skin tone for her little face. We've got the blue there for her dress. That's going to be a lovely colour. I love that colour. And then we've got white for the stripes on the cup and her little gloves. And then this one, I don't know if you can see that. Oops. That's got a coating on it. And it's what you call an Aurora Borealis, which it's like oil on water, like the Northern Lights. And it's a special coating that they put onto the drills, which just gives it that extra sparkle and that little colour change as you're moving it about. And the one next to it as well, the pink, is the same. That one has the coating on it. Uh, just do be careful if you use anything other than the wax that comes with these kits because you can find if you use anything that's too strong it can take that coating off your drills so just a tip to be aware of there but if you're just using your pen and your wax and um, that you do get in your kit you will be fine with that but yeah that's a real uh, extra bonus getting those two in that kit so that's going to be her shoes and Beth is, oh look, you can just see her little frilly pants there. <laughs> and her bow are in the pink. Oh, that's lovely. And then the green and like turquoisey blue crystals that you're getting are going to go on the leaves at the edges in your four corners. So it's a lovely frame on this card with those four corners of leaves. It's going to look really good. So that's Minnie Mouse. Let's just pop her to one side a moment those over there and then the next one we've got is Dory and Marlin Now I thought that was Nemo but maybe there's a different one um, I'm not really sure as I say I've not seen the second film oh this looks like a really big size fish on this one okay same packaging and um, again eight plus but with discretion you can use um, a different you know you can uh, do this with younger people Right, so, okay, let's, oh, let's keep the package in there. Got your drills, again, it's the same toolkit with your standard three-placer, 
your single placer on that end, you've got your nice little green boat for putting your drills in, your wax, and they give you plenty of bags. You're going to have quite a few spares over there. So that's your little tool kit. I'll pop that over there. Now again, with my habit I'm getting into, put my sticker on the right side of my plastic. Now this one, all of your fish, apart from the eyes, look at that expression on there. That's wonderful the way they're looking at each other. I think these two are going to get into mischief, don't you? <laughs> so all of the fish, all of uh, Marlin and Dory are going to be uh, covered in your drills to give them that sparkle and pop and the background isn't sticky so you will just do your fish there but oh, look at those expressions it's like hey come on what can we get up to today <laughs> lovely underwater scene that one i mean i think disney sort of like you can send them to anybody um you know even if you've got an 80 year old person that you know that does watch disney they'll probably find that this card is uh, a bit of fun and probably make them smile. And that's what we want to do these days, isn't it? Make everybody smile, get that feel good. Again, blank inside. And again, you've got, oh, Disney Pixar on this one. Look with your license there. And uh, you've got your code there, which is, oops, DNY 800, which I presume is Disney 800. Okay, oh, wouldn't it be nice if they got 800 different cards? <laughs> okay, yeah, on both sides of your drills, so no fear of losing your drills or getting muddled up there. Okay, it's the same size card, your 7 inch by 7 inch. Let's have a quick look at the drills. Ooh, get into these packets. There you are. How many colours do we have on this one? So we've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. We've got ten different colours. These are all resin drills on this one. Okay, so we've got your black. Oh, look at these colours. Really sparkly. Your proper resin drills, these. All the facets on them. We've got two different oranges there. We've got a burnt orange there. Look at that one. And then all your blues and your white. So by giving you all the different colours, you get, that's how you get your depth of the colour. So there's three different oranges um, on Marlin and you can see there it's sort of like an ombre effect graduated in to make it darker and that just gives you the depth into the picture. And then Dory again has got four different colours of blue and again that's going to just really make that pop from the card there. Love that. So yeah, so that's your two Disney card kits and I think anybody of any age would love to receive these. I like Disney. I'm getting on a bit and I like Disney. <laughs> so our next card kit. Now then, this one is actually an A4 size card and they are like an A3 size um, piece of paper folded in half to make an A4 card. So again, they come beautifully packaged and it says it's 29 centimetres by 21 centimetres. Again, we have all your, uh, in, sorry, not your instructions, your contents on the back as to what's in your kit. And at the moment, they do just do the four larger size cards. I have done the owl and that is superb. And for anybody that likes that little wizard, that is a wonderful card to do, but that is a barn owl. Um, barn owls and tawny owls are my favourite. They're about 50-50 as to which one I like best. You've got your cow, which is a fantastic card for um, a young man or an older man, or even a lady. Ladies like cows too. And then you've got your little pussy cat looks sat on a rock, obviously waiting for a fish to come by, I think, there. But the one we've got is the unicorn, and it's super, this one. So let's get into it and have a look. Again, I'm going to carefully open it because I'm saving my packaging. Okay, you do get your instructions on the back there telling you how to diamond paint. So if you are getting this as a present for somebody, then uh, they will be able to follow these and know how to diamond paint. Again, I think this is one of the 
easier crafts to do, shall we say. You need patience, obviously, to be able to sit and put your drills or your gems on. But it's just so wonderful and you get such fantastic results at the end of it. And I've met so many fantastic people through the forums um, and obviously through doing YouTube videos as well. Um, I say met, not at the moment with COVID, but met through the different chat, uh, groups and chats. I'm just sharing ideas and encouraging people along. So there you are. It says here, look, no mess, no fuss and no glue, which is wonderful. All you need really is just a pair of scissors to open your little packets and you've got a whole craft project in a, in a bag here. So pop that to one side there. Okay. Wow, this looks wonderful. It's got a wonderful rainbow on it as well, which is very relevant at the moment with rainbows. Okay, take that out of the packet. So again, we've got our same little tool kit um, with your single placer, your three placer on your pink pen, your little green bow, plenty of baggies again. The amount of bags that they give you is wonderful. You know, you can use those just as storage if you want to keep all your spare drills in. Okay, pop that to one side. Let's have a look at this card. So, oh wow, again, super quality. That is a really, I don't know if you can hear that, I'm not quite sure how you can get across the thickness of a card. Um, on a video but like the smaller cards I would say you've got probably at least a 300 uh, GSM card there stands up really well that's not gonna blow over in the breeze she's just trying to flap it <laughs> and you're not gonna get it curling in and uh, falling over there that's a really good card look at that I mean this this table isn't exactly level um, and it's still stood up there so we've got this beautiful unicorn rearing up and it's got all butterflies and sparkles coming away from it where it's possibly stamped its feet and it's just reared up and you're getting all that sparkle. Now, the only uh, part again on this that you are going to put your drem drems? gems and drills on. <laughs> The only part of this that you are going to put uh, drills and gems on is the part with the letters on. Uh, so that's all of your unicorn. And then we've just looks like we're possibly going to put a star at the end of his uh, horn there. And then all that rainbow, that's going to be fantastic to do. Love that. And then all the little stars. What I would quite possibly do on these stars is use my uh, craft buddy um, glue which comes with the fine applicator tip and just put some little blobs of glue and then possibly put glitter on there or maybe even put some other little tiny gems that I've got. Um, Craft Buddy do sell uh, gems as well. So if you've not got enough in your spare gems or drills left over from other kits, you can still get the um, spare ones from Craft Buddy, which is great. And then even the flower, oh, I don't beg your pardon, even the flowers down here, look, I've all got gems on i hadn't realized but they have so all these flowers are going to be done as well you can see there all these have got letters on so it's a good way if you've got children doing these they can get used to their alphabet because they can spot an a a b or a c to put the gems onto which again it's a little bit of learning from a craft kit which is good okay it's blank inside again so you can put your verse um or whatever you want to put in there um, as I say, usually I will put um, an insert in here and uh, print something out to go in there. But that's a wonderful card. Let's measure it. Let's say it does look A4 size, but we'll just have a quick look. And that is ooh, about 20, just under 21 centimetres, which is just about eight and a quarter inches by it's about 18 and a half centimeters which is 11 and a quarter inches so it's a really good size i mean that would make a superb picture but as a card for somebody um they're just gonna love it it's definitely a keeper this one you get your nice envelope white envelope so and it's a proper card envelope it's not one that 
it's got writing or anything inside it's uh, a good envelope there that you can pop in good sturdy envelope as well nice thickness so that's not going to come apart if you are posting your card okay let's have a look at these wow there's a lot of colors in here okay let's have a look Lots of different gems and sparkles. It's just sparkling away at me. I hope the video picks this up a little bit. Just pop that packet on one side. So let's have a look at these. Wow, look at all these different colours. Goodness me. Okay, oh, we've got two separate strips. So how many colours have we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. So there's 21 different packets of um, gems and drills, which is wonderful. So let's start. Where shall we start? We'll start with the resin crystal to start off with, the resin gems to start off with. So we've got white, we've got like a fawny colour, and then like a, a deeper fawn, and that's like a very, like a mocha colour, and then a cream. Oops, sorry about the crinkling and then we go on to our crystal gems now so we've got purple these are all going to go in the rainbow i think do you remember richard of york gave battle in vain as to how to remember your colors on your rainbow <laughs> red indigo violet green yellow orange and red <laughs> okay so purple it's like a, an orangey red color we've got blue got green a lot of these will be the flowers as well we've got gold there we've got like a, it's not quite a full silver there's a little bit of a tint to that that's like a very pale champagne gold and like a greeny gold and that's like a, a very pale orange gold again another shade of gold there wow how many different shades of gold have we got there i'm running out of things to say and a whoa hot pink hot pink i love hot pink and then you plain silver crystals at the end okay and then your special ones oh look at these okay so we've got little gold markings and then oh look at those they're like an a b aurora borealis teardrop that's a wonderful oil on water and then that's so that's like a ready uh, coating that that one's got so it's giving you like a red uh, sparkle and these have got like a purple bluey sparkle to them again in a teardrop and then all your little stars which are lovely look at those little stars little silver stars oh and we've got an interloper there look we've got an extra teardrop that's just escaped come to join the star party okay i'm gonna put my sticker on my front cover so that i know which way around is which and that's the unicorn card so thank you craft buddy i love these we've got the unicorn card which I love. We've got Dory and Marley, which is just such fun. We've got Minnie Mouse, which again is a lovely little craft kit there. Great for anybody to sew. And then finally, our lovely dragon gothic notebook. So wonderful. I'm going to really enjoy doing these and thank you again once again craft buddy again if you are wanting to purchase any of these from craft buddy you can save 15% by using my code and it is down in the description below so I hope you've enjoyed this unboxing and looking at all these wonderful products with me if you'd like to see more please subscribe and you'll be notified when my next video comes up but thanks for watching and I hope to see you all again soon bye